Okay, guys, never ever do what I did once in my childhood. Uh, nope, that wasn't it. I remember when the first time I actually played this game, I thought Gromps weren't actually going to eat your critters because I didn't actually listen to the cutscenes. When I was herding some creatures, I ran into... Whoa. Well, first off, I ran into a wall. I remember that. That was happy times. Because <coughs> walls are friendly. I remember I herded my creatures near to a Gromp, and he started to eat. He, in fact, was so fucking hungry. He was hungry. And I am actually going to skip those for a minute, because I don't need to hurt those yet. Now, remember, never, ever let a loose Gromp in the field. Always check carefully around any area for Groms, because they eat anything. Anything. Mostly anything. Yes, actually everything. They can eat anything. And they aren't picky, so... So, actually, eating something may come... Whoa. Come on! No shit! Bitch. Ha. 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 In fact, this cage isn't even that small. Why doesn't he just come and attack me? It's like... Just past his feet. So, what's his... Where's his problem? Uh, I don't know, you know, game logic. But yeah, always check for Gromps. That's my strategy. And maybe you should take it into consideration as well. Always check around Gromps and make sure that they're trapped. Or at least out of the area. But there's also a thing about Gromps. They don't like each other as well. Which makes it useful for herding. So, you can put two Gromps in a brawl. Ow. Not a Smash Brawl. Not a Smash Bros Brawl, because that'd be silly. That'd be my game. Get him together. Yes, I got him. Right, let's get him inside. I said, let's get them inside. Right, that's quite a bit. Alright, let's get these dupes around. Here we go. So yeah, what was I explaining? Oh yeah, Gromps. They don't like each other. They really don't. None of them like each other. And it's weird how all of them are male. How do they mate? Who knows? i am got to stop talking about this. I gotta stop talking fast like the mighty Gondi! I will never say that again. You can make two Gromps uh, fight each other, which they fight for quite long. So you can also, while they are distracted fighting each other, you can herd any creatures away from them. And uh, you have a clear path. You have a clear path. So it's good, it's good that while they're distracted, and so, you know. Wait, four? There's five. Here's the thing about dupes. They can't survive great falls, but they can survive, like, that little drop. For some reason, there's still four. Alright, let's get these... Yeah, like I just like I just showed you there, they uh, can't survive big drops, but if there's a drop, but if there's a fall with water in, uh, they'll be able to swim downstream. Well, actually, no, they can't swim technically; they just float. Where'd you go? Get over, it. sons of bitches. Right, I know my commentary isn't going to be that interesting sometimes playing this because I'm focusing too much on herding these fuckers. Dupes are quite annoying to herd. At least when I, at least when I get uh, more equipment, I'll be able to herd other creatures there. Right, now there is a little cutscene I want to show you, which is useless now, but you have to do this later because you're not able to get to the uh, other padlock. So I'll show you it. It involves this tree. Shit. Huh? Yeah, you. What? You're a tree? Yeah, yeah, so I'm a tree. What are you doing, kid? I'm on my way to the great tournament. I am going to defeat Sador. What? You win the great tournament? Defeat Sador? <laughs> I stepped. 
Nobody talks about Seydolf that much. He's never even seen until the end of the game. Weird. Fucking obnoxious tree. Right, and I really didn't know what you had to do here before. I thought you had to use your rod. I keep, I'll just call it a rod. I know it's the herding stick. But you have to come back here later. Right, how... Oh, sorry. <laughs> that was a PS button. Right, okay. Now I've got them... Now I've got them both of the uh, padlock... Now I've got them both of the locks open. I'll go to this area to get our new herding equipment. Would you like to go to Midmere? You can't even complete this level unless you get this as well, so let's go. On our way to our second complete herding level, Midmere, which is based in a desert for some reason. So we went from a feet. So we went from regular fields and we all we have to do is go up just up here and we are in a desert doesn't make that much of sense and this only has one padlock yes I will save thank you it's weird because I always thought if you used a quick, a quick save in this game I always thought like it I thought it always counted as a reg an actual save over your game, but the quick save doesn't actually do anything. It just saves over the other kind of day. It it just does a quick save mid level. It doesn't actually save over your actual level data because when you save on the map screen, that's a different save file for some odd fucking reason. I don't know. It was so confusing. I really thought that was the way you had to save in this game, and I always did that. I never thought you could actually save in the map screen, even though it came up. I was weird. At least I wasn't that stupid like Zack. Mm -hmm. Right, now I think there's some bells behind here. Even though I'm not really collecting bells. And for some reason we get these weird camera shots. So yeah, we're in a desert level. Pretty deserty, randomly. Next NPC. Oh, I'm sorry. My name's Gertie. Hello there, Gertie. I am Skybird. Don't those creatures bother you? They bother me greatly, my boy. I have lived here many, many years and can find no means to be rid of them. Wow. Don't you get hungry just sitting there? Ah, yes. Yes, I do. But every now and again, one of those little devils jumps a little too close, and bam, they aren't the most pleasant tasting critters, and the fur makes them hard to swallow. Ugh, I could get rid of them if you like. I would be most grateful, but you'll need to get the magic flute hidden behind these doors. <laughs> 